consider how important discipleship is, no matter who you are, no matter what you do. Jesus' primary mission was to die for our sins. Now, that could have been taken care of really quickly. Now, bear with me for just a minute. I think this is kind of an important foundation for discipleship, and maybe not something you've thought about before. But he could have just accomplished the work of redemption by doing staging a massive rebellion when he first appeared. Um, he could have easily gotten himself arrested, crucified, in the grave, uh, rose immediately, and returned to heaven. But he didn't do that. He spent three years on earth living with a group of disciples, healing, teaching, interacting with him. Even after his resurrection, Jesus did not immediately ascend into heaven, but he spent 40 more days with his disciples, teaching them, encouraging them, eating meals with them, and finally giving them the charge to share the message of salvation and make disciples. It seems obvious that he wanted more than just a group of people to sort of grab the goody of salvation and then do whatever they wanted with their lives. He wanted, he chose to train, to teach, to create a specific kind of people. He wanted to make disciples. He wanted a group of people who knew him well, who understood the values of the kingdom of God that he had come to make real, and disciples who would share the totality of that message with the world, who would live out the message of redeemed people that he demonstrated to them. The most important thing we can then do in response is, obviously, to become a disciple.